Alright people, welcome to this very new, very unusual video of for my channel. So this is not House of Iron 4, this is not House of Iron 3, but this is um, as you can see the size of campaigns case blue. Now I think I mentioned in one of my previous videos that I was about I mean I was about I would have made this video. Because this is actually my not my my first time but Okay, let's say this is my my first time I decided to play this game um, in a multiplayer session, especially as you can see from this uh, this settings, the play by email session with a friend of mine who is I would say quite good in As of Iron Four, but he uh, never played. Hearts of Iron 3. And I think that if you're watching this video and you've been following my channel for, I would say, a long time, and I think you may understand that, um, honestly, I think I'm quite good in Hearts of Iron 3. I like this blitzing strategy of encircling enemy troops and then just annihilating them. And um, yeah, so he told me, oh, I would like to find somebody to, to play this game. And initially, I, you know, I really didn't care about it, but then when I was looking information about the German Order of Battle for Case Blue, I stumbled into this game, and before accepting the, the real challenge, I decided to give it a try, and honestly, I would say I really like it. Uh, I like the... Um, uh, artillery and air bombardment mechanics that when you shoot with the, the artillery you need to wait one week, three turns I think it is, in order to uh, stock again, stockpile the ammunition. I like the supply system and most important I like the railway conversion system that you need four, four turns, so eight days again, to allow your engineers to convert the Soviet gauge into the, the, the German gauge. And we decided to play this game and well I don't want to spoil anything but judging by the fact that I'm really smiling you can already imagine how did it go. So this is basically the, the, the screen that we agreed um no 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 not the screen we agreed sorry um this is the, the screen with the settings we, we agreed to to have for this game. So, uh, fog of war for sure, uh, protection, high command rules. So, the high command rules basically um, you are con you receive orders from the high command which are uh, conquer a city within that date or hold a certain position for, I don't know, 10 turns. Dismissal defeat rule. So, in case you fail to accomplish the high command orders, you may lose the game. Axis minor means um, Romania, Hungary and Italy, they, they have some special orders, I don't remember now. Uh, command and control rules, the Soviets do have some penalties at the beginning of the game. Uh, fog of war on statistic, I think this is self explanatory More constrained oil, this was... I decided to have it, you know, to have a more realistic immersion of the game. Allow frigate the divisions... Um, well, this helped me in deploying the famous park troopers. Uh, we decided not to take unlimited oil because this is just too cheaty. We though decided to disa disable weather because uh, I tried once and it could be annoying if you are on the offensive and say for one turn you have to um, stop everything because it's raining and the whole step turns into mud. Uh, I will talk about this later now. Hardcore recon rules um, is just to make um, the spotting of the enemy units more difficult basically. 
And the free setup is, I think, one of the, mo one of the most favorite because it allows you to move every unit on the map before starting. And when I received all his screenshots, I, I realized which were his intentions. But, I, I mean, as you will see in the video, I mean, he was very cunning because he tried... Um, well, I don't, I don't want to say that, but <laughs> you will see it. But I really panicked at the beginning of, of the campaign because you will see that, you will see that, yeah. And overall, I would say I like this game. I, I'm not very used to the um, I go, you go system of this turn based system, but as a game per se, I really appreciate, appreciate it. And now. I would say enough talking, I leave you to the video, I hope you will enjoy it. I don't know if I will make more videos about this game, but one thing is for sure, more videos, hopefully more videos concerning the new Black High 10 mode for House of Valentine will be on the way on my channel, that's for sure. Alright, then thanks for watching, I hope you will enjoy it.
Good. Uh-huh.